On my daily Rants and Raves video today, I want to talk about a couple of issues that continue to resurface here in Central Florida. And uh, they're really <laughs> crystallized in two stories that have developed locally um, that I talked about on the program this morning. One is the fact that we have too few serious challenges to incumbents who just continue to get reelected for lack of credible, well-organized, and well-financed opposition. And the other is how people get fantastic, cushy jobs for which they have little or no qualification. All they have are the right political connections. Now, here's the way the two stories came down that embody those two problems we chronically see here in Central Florida. First of all, Orange County Mayor Teresa Jacobs, whom I hold in high regard, whether I agree with her on all the issues or not, she's sharp as a tack and really committed to the job and knows what she's doing. She is going to have serious opposition. Former Orlando Police Chief Val Demings has announced that she will jump into the race against Teresa Jacobs. This is nothing but good for we the people. We're going to have a terrific campaign. We're going to have the issues debated, and then the people can decide. It's great to have credible opposition for a change in a major local race. Then we have the situation where Steve Precord of the Florida legislature, he just resigned his post there, has been appointed head of the Orlando Orange County Expressway Authority. He's gone from $29,000 a year to $175,000 or more. That's nice if you can get it, and I, I, I don't begrudge anybody making more money. But here's the issue. He got the job. He got the job despite the fact that he's never run a toll agency before, and the requirements listed for this job are that you have run someone else's toll agency somewhere for eight years or more. Steve Precourt is a civil engineer, okay? And those are his only qualifications for this job. He got this job, in my opinion, and this is what grinds my gears, strictly because he is politically well-connected. I think we need to end that practice. What do you think? That's what I think, and I'll see you for the next edition of Bud Hedinger Live right here on FM 104.5 AM 540 WFLA.